Hi and welcome to another Instrument Choice Support video. In this video we'll demonstrate how to calibrate the Expert pH Pocket Tester, the IC Expert pH. The pH sensor must be hydrated to perform correctly and should be stored in electrode storage solution. If the pH electrode has been stored dry, soak as long as needed in storage solution to rehydrate the sensor. This should be for a minimum of 10 minutes before calibration and use. For best results, Instrument Choice recommends a minimum of two point calibration. For this example, we will calibrate the expert pH to pH 4 and pH 7. We are using the following buffer solutions it's pH 4 250R and pH 7 250R, and we have some water for rinsing the electrode between calibrations. Start by pressing the power button to switch the unit on. If this is your first time using and calibrating the meter, you will need to choose your buffer set selection. To do this, press the menu key. When BUF appears on the screen, press enter. Then press the menu button to choose between USA or NIST buffer values for automatic calibration. When your desired buffer set is on the screen, press enter to confirm and return to the setup menu. Time to calibrate the meter. Rinse the meter in water and gently shake off any excess. Place into the first buffer solution. Ensure that the electrode is in at least 20 millimeters of buffer solution. Then press the cal button. The display will show cal followed by the default pH value. The clock icon will blink on the display while the meter is stabilizing. A tick will appear on the top line and the buffer solution on the bottom line when the buffer is automatically detected. At this stage, you can either press no keys for three seconds or press enter to accept the value straight away. The meter will display done to confirm the calibration. pH seven calibration is complete. Rinse the electrode in water, gently shake dry, then move on to the next buffer solution. In this case, pH four. Immerse the electrode into the solution at least 20 millimeters, then press the cal button. As with the first calibration step, the display will show cal followed by the default pH value. The clock icon will blink on the display while the meter is stabilizing. A tick will appear on the top line and the buffer solution on the bottom line once the buffer is automatically detected. At this stage again, either press no keys for three seconds or press enter to accept the value straight away. The meter will display done, confirm the calibration. Two point calibration is complete. The meter is ready to take accurate pH measurements. Remember, once you've finished using your meter, store it away with a cap on and some electrode storage solution, so it's ready for its next use. And that's how to calibrate the IC Expert PH. For more information on this meter, speak with an Instrument Choice Scientist. Call 1300 737 871 or email customer-service at instrumentchoice.com.au. We hope that you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching.